everyone, I'm Sunita from Lessons Lane. A warm welcome to my bathroom. Today, we are going to learn the bathroom vocabulary. Are you excited? I'm super excited. Let's get started. It's a shower handle. It helps to operate a shower. We call it a rain shower. So in some bathrooms, you will see a handheld shower. You could see here handheld shower. So with the help of this shower, you can wash your body. All right. When you get up in the morning, what do you do? You go to the toilet and uh, of course you fresh yourself. You sit on something. What do you call it? Okay. It's a hot seat that you're talking about. Okay. Just kidding. It's a toilet lid. Right? Then this portion, we call it, it's a toilet seat. Then this part, if you see here, this, it's a toilet bowl. All right? freshen up don't forget to flush so for that what you have to use it's a flusher so with the help of this let me tell you so this is the bottle comes from here so don't forget to push it Sunita what are you doing here I'm getting ready I have to go for a shoot oh my god you're already doing a shoot, Sunita. What are you doing? So, uh, let me introduce a few things when you do your toothbrush. So, many things you are using here. It's a mirror. We call it a faucet or you can say a water tap. It's a handle. With the help of this handle, you can use hot water or cold water. Then it's a sink. We call it a drain. Under this drain, you'll find some plumbings. Plumbings are the pipes that bring water to the faucet and away from the drain. Sometimes that sink gets filled with water. Then how are you going to drain? So this is how we take out that unwanted water with the help of this drain. So drain is a noun and a verb. So we could say like this, we drained the swimming pool. All right, bathroom cedar. I'm tired. I want to rest here. I'm sitting under bathroom cedar. Okay, it's time to use my toothbrush. Tongue cleaner. I have a toothpaste. Where do I put all these things? I put it into a holder. Let me show you something else now. It's a shampoo. Then we have a conditioner. I'm going to show you something interesting. It's a foot scrapper. Let me show you how to use it. You have to use it like this way. It helps you to remove the dirt from your heels. It's very good. You should use it on a daily basis. I, I use it on a daily basis. You can clean your feet with it. People might say you shouldn't use it on a daily basis. I would advise you, you should use it. There is no harm because this hard part helps to take out that dirt from your heels. And then you don't have to go for pedicure every week. You can save your money so just go for that pedicure you can take your pedicure just once a month do you sanitize your toilet seat 
let me show you something toilet seat sanitizer when some guest arrives at your place then you can use it however i would advise you you should use it let me tell you like this way you can you know, spray here and after that just sit on your hot seat <laughs> just kidding i don't use a, a soap bar on my body what do i use actually i use a shower gel i put that shower gel on my loofah and after that you can like do it like this way bathroom hand towel shower cap i want to hide my hand towel on a hook look at this cute soap holder i have another one also and it's a soap bar i use my face wash on a daily basis liquid hand wash where is that that inside this bottle it's not a bottle we call it a dispenser it's a laundry basket where you put your dirty clothes it's a mug what do you do with it of course while bathing you have to take out water with the help of a mug and where do you fill that water that's here we call it a bucket okay i hope you have enjoyed today's video give me a thumbs up it will help me share this video across the globe so they come to know about the bathroom vocabulary and they are also going to mention something in the comment section maybe i forgot something and they have something else to tell us why don't you also do the same <laughs> all right i'll meet you uh uh before saying that i have to say something else don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel i'll meet you in the next class bye for now